morning has broken, blackbird has spoken. It's a great big water flow in the Nordic fjords. <laughs> Don't have the rights to the song. Good morning, missus. Oh, got some crystals. That's good. Show me them. You found them yesterday in Alden when we yeah. went to Strin, so, didn't you? So I dropped We think they might be them. quartz. And now we're going to go for breakfast. Um, and it will be the same as it always is for me. Beige. You've got a magic trick. Okay, whoa. I went through Yes. Okay. Oh dear. Okay. Maybe not for me. Come on then, Pearly. No, that one you can't magic. Yeah. Oh my goodness, look, we've come at an amazing time. Barely anyone here, this is great. So I've got breakfast with a view and also this view. How lovely is that? Little top tip for you this morning if you come on a cruise is to bring water bottles because they have refill stations. So we're going to go to one now. Do you no think I should? Required. But you have to take it out before it overfills. Okay. Do you think I should become a vlogger? Do you think I'm good at it? Yeah, I think so. Zooming on my face. <laughs> God's sake, stop this. <laughs> but we're leaving. Let's selfie. The... <laughs> we're leaving the ground. That's what they do. God, <laughs> we're leaving the ground, don't you? <laughs> and this bum is so good. <laughs> gorgeous, gorgeous <laughs> girls do hello girls in the rain. <laughs> Everybody's getting off the ship for this because it's so easy. You just walk down that road and then up there and then there's the big waterfall. This is such a nice little easy jaunt to have. You don't need to book it. It's very, it's like a comfortable walk. If you're not very athletic, which let's face it, I am not, this is a doable walk. Um, it is raining, hence this stunning look. No such thing as bad weather, only bad clothing choices. And what I will say is, my trainers are really soggy already. I think probably should have thought about footwear a bit more, but we move, literally, we move. Look how clear the water is. You can see the stones at the bottom. And here she is, the beautiful waterfall. So powerful. Can you hear it, Darcy? Like, you can hear the power of that. Uh, yeah. <laughs> When we wake, hear the birds and see the sun Side by side our fears are done All the good times just begun Oh, we know what we have, let's hold on tight Found what we're looking for in life It's a bit rainy, isn't it? Nah. <laughs> I've got my With you and I, the future is bright. I wonder if there's anything in it. You and I, is there we anything got in it. there? Oh no, just the big wheel. We don't need no more. Even in the hard times, you and I can weather wow. any storm. Isn't it wild that from that little river there, we come under this road bridge, let me just zoom you out, zoom out, zoom out, zoom out, and kablammy, it's this, it's just enormous, like, look at the size of that rock and how the water's all eroded, the riverbed, that's just so impressive. So we've walked from the ship across and then up here, that bit was quite steep, and now, I can see Liam and Pearl over there. We're gonna walk down kind of like through the houses. It's a lot less steep that way. And that'll be our little, our little loop. Hear the crickets, see the moon. Side by side and through and through. No limit to what we can do. Oh, we know what we have, let's hold on tight. And we're back, ready to board Iona again, just through there. Apologies for the very low angle here, I've got you balanced on a can of water. Um, I packed this with us, it's a travel 
pillow look it goes on your case so when you're like going through the airport or the port or whatever you can put it on your like little trolley handles um it's a pillow that folds out into a blanket and i am going to sit on my little sofa here just there in the conservatory bit and i'm going to put this blanket over my legs and like this and i'm going to read my book this one i'm going to start on this do you remember i saw uh we had that experience with jacqueline wilson at the beginning of the trip that'll be in another vlog um so i'm gonna start reading that whilst i enjoy this view out here don't mind my coat just drying off it's not raining anymore um and i've ordered room service for the girls and i and then we're gonna have that and then we are going on an excursion liam is Oh, you can't see him through there. He's on the bed, he's watching a film. Are you thinking about going to the cinema, did you say? Maybe, yeah. Can I film you or no? No. No, that's fine. He's no. all sprawled out. Yeah. <laughs> I might do, I probably won't though. You can do that. I'm going to go to the gym. Oof. All right then. Anyway, it's just nice. We're all just sort of like chilled and doing our own thing. The girls are doing some colouring, I think, or playing, or just, everyone's just very like peaceful and relaxed, and this is nice. Can I just say this blanket gets a 10 out of 10 from me. It is so soft. It's like one of those, you know, the bunny soft blankets. It's so lovely. It's um, ever snug. I'll link it if you're interested. This is the life. It's Food gone. has arrived. Sorry. <laughs> That's all right. It's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. That's a foot. It's lovely. Like no, Pearl's got a little sandwich situation. I Darcy, are you going to open that up? Darcy. Oh, what's this? Is this I, for later? I will do some trades, okay. A bit of bargaining. Lovely, lovely. Um, so open your box. No, because it'll fall off. No, it won't. Whoa. Whoa. What is that? Delicianus. You won't like those. Oh. Unfortunately. Good thing is I will. What is in it? It's um, jalapeno peppers with cream cheese. Now the nacho, Darcy. Or is it just cheese? Look, I'll bite into it. Oh, I don't like jalapenos. Hooray. Hooray! <laughs> right, so it's a bit later on and I'm taking the girls. <laughs> yes, I do say it. It's a bit later on and taking the girls out on an excursion. We're going on the same coach tour that we did last year because we just loved it so, so much. It's like a really nice coach tour that takes you to some beauty spots all around the local area. We really enjoy that kind of thing. So it's just me and the girls, little girl gang it. trip. Oh yeah, got a bag of girl. snacks, got their coats, got dry trainers on, dry them with hair dryers, and we're off. So we have to go down to floor three, don't we? Pearl's got different, Pearl, are those shoes tight enough for you? Do you want me to redo them? They're tight. They're tight, are they? Are you Welcome sure? Welcome to the passage, I'm going to open it. Come on, life. A bit strange, somewhat varies have also the possibility that a nose can open, but not this one. Wow. Look at that and it's a very, it started with a, a big can plastic, it and, it, and the money yeah, that they used more was, uh, was used to, to uh, investigate uh, breast cancer. Cool uh, breast cancer. Right. Glaciers move like very, very slowly, like you won't notice it if you just stood there. Mm -hmm. But if you put it on time lapse, you'd be able to see it. So that glacier over yeah. there. That would have been like up there last year. Wow. We'll have to look at some facts at how fast they move, won't we? I was pretty sure I was told in the geography lesson, but I forgot. You've forgotten. <laughs> That's okay. We've gotten off to have a little look at these little summer houses. What are you singing? Eh. Uh, I can't remember what it was called. Bye bye. <sighs> Savages, savages, dirty bottom yeah. feelings. Is that from Pocahontas? <laughs> yeah. Right, now it was alright climbing up here. But. <laughs> Just hold my hand. You're yeah, all right. I do. <laughs> it's wet. <laughs> Come on, Pelt, shout the road. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if I'm helping you or you're helping me. I found shape. You found shape? So where are they going? Look, I can see some sheep fur. Look. Oh, should we take a time for memorabilia for Liam? Oh, not, not, not too sure. But look, there's sheep over there. Right, I think we're getting back on. Oh, no, no, okay, everyone's got a bit feral. Is it glacier or glacier? Can someone tell me in the comments, please? Can clear that water, please. I'm sure you'll see a lot of faces. Right, here and comes the glacier, here glacier. The left, there is this patch of snow. Oh, still. patch of snow. And there's a cave in there. Oh, and that's where a troll lives. Yeah. Oh, there's a troll lives in there, Pearl. 
Is it? Maybe it's not. It isn't a patch of snow. The troll is a cave dweller. There's a troll in there. What do you think to that? Uh, actually, uh, way down to the to the to the, to the other So this lake here is the site of an avalanche. Let's go down here, and there used to be a summer farm down here, and an avalanche came from a glacier, glacier glacier. <laughs> Just me and Pearly. So apparently, under this water are the little houses and roads. There were no casualties because it all happened in the winter when no one was there, thankfully. So that's good. It's okay. If they drained this, you would find all sorts of interesting things. I think you can sort of like, sort of see a bit of a road there because it's so clear and still it's really reflecting all of this, but very interesting. We've got some friends following us, haven't we? <laughs> they want to come on our tour, don't they, Pearl? Yeah. Come aboard the Iona. <laughs> this is what I was talking about. This is the kind of thing that you'd find underneath. That's where Pearl and I just were. <laughs> now there's... Are they going to go for a little swim? Don't get too close, Pearly. That's probably close enough. Look, behind this tree, you can actually see the remains of the houses. Look. Wow. That's so cool. There they are. Water's so clean, isn't it? So beautiful, Here even in the rain. Rock. This next stop is one that we went to last year with Liam and he was doing his skimming of stones. We've got such lovely memories here. There's like a little beach bit over there. And then there was also a pier. Oh, they've got a little like building on the pier. Remember girls, we took a picture. Let's spin you around. So I have a picture of the girls on the very end of this pier, girls and Liam. And there was no like little shed. Don't do that please, Pearly. That's a surefire way to fall in. I've not brought a towel. So I have a picture of them at the end of this. There were no ships or boats or the little shed on it last year. And then also last year we were playing on this beach for ages. I wonder if this bit's new or they were just skimming stones kind of like in the gap. I'll have to watch the footage again. Have a little look on the beach, yeah. Can you remember coming here with Daddy last year? Yeah. Yeah? I think surely that must have been here because that doesn't look like just a temporary structure. Oi, oi. I'm looking for crystals. Looking for crystals? I'm sure there'll be some crystals and shells. Or well, maybe some shell. shells. Is it a shell? I think so. Where? Look there. Yeah. If it's not got anything in it, you can have it. I think that's empty. I think you can have that little guy. Nice. Yeah. Has it got a little friend in there? I don't think so. Isn't that heavy? So peaceful here. Can you see the waterfalls up there? I love also all these grass roofs. Oh, it's just so nice. This tour is called the Majestic Tour, and it really is majestic. I love it. A good thing because uh, if the ship would be gone, uh, we would uh, have to visit IKEA first because I don't have that many pets. <laughs> We're off the tour now, back on board. I've put a more sort of eveningy top on. Just felt really hot in my like jewel stripy top, so I put this on. And we're heading down to the atrium because Liam said he saw Wallace and Gromit. Oh! I love the captions of Dave. We have had a lovely day. We'll command to let go all of the lines of the park port. We'll thrust the ship off the dock whilst moving astern. We'll then swing the ship around a full 180 degrees and then increase speed and proceed down the Garanga Fjord at around 17 knots. All being well, we should be exiting Garanga Fjord at around 8 pm tonight. I've been having some trouble with my left eye and I washed out again for like the 15th time when we got back um, but if it looks all red and sore that is why it's like really bothering me anyway thrilling little update for you there here's the grand atrium oh I love it in here you can't not feel uplifted the second you like walk into this space it's just so lovely I hope we haven't missed Wallace and Gromit because before we came on the trip hang on <laughs> 
earlier in front of me. Before we came on the trip, I was showing Pearl all of the Wallace and Gromit films, and we watched we watched the wrong trousers, didn't we, Pearly? Gromit on the moon. Gromit on the moon. Yeah, I can. I think I can see them. I can see them. That's exciting, isn't it? Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Oh, Pearly. <laughs> that is so nice, Pearly. Say bye. Oh, she just said bye, Gromit. Bye, Gromit. Just having a little rendezvous in the atrium with my, with my sweet, sweet nectar. Oh, look at that shot. Look at it. Oh, yes. I am loving these views with my diet coat. We're doing a 180, I think, to reposition the ship. Just like, it's just, it's like from a film, isn't it? It's like from a film. Yeah, yes, yes. I feel like I'm in Avatar and also a little bit Jurassic Park as well. Yeah. Yes, and right, Avatar, Jurassic Park and Frozen. That's what I feel like I'm in. This all really makes sense to you if you watched the vlogs last year. So Liam just took the girls to the buffet for dinner and they've gone to kids club and look what he brought me back from the buffet even though we're about to go out for dinner ourselves. Da da da, da 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 da. It was my favorite dessert last time we came and I made a big thing of it and I said before we came here, I really hope they have treacle sponge with custard and then he messaged and he was like, they got it at the buffet and he brought me one back. If that is not the definition of love, I don't know what is. I won't spin the camera around because that'll be a treat for everyone's eyes. Flippin' heck, we're about to go down for dinner. No, I haven't dumped you. <laughs> no. I wouldn't be crying this hard if we did. Um, I'd be celebrating. <laughs> we just watched, I've been watching like in chunks over the last few days. What's it called? A Man Called Otto. I think that's what it was called. With Tom Hanks in it and I just watched the last like half an hour of it and it's like broken me. I am a broken woman. We're about to go out for a lovely dinner and I just want to like cry for a thousand years. A nice child free start to the evening. <laughs> but instead, got my handbag ready and we're gonna go and have a lovely meal. Do some dancing. <laughs> I can't even put more eye makeup on because this dodgy eye, that's why I've gone light on the makeup. Anyway, should we just go? Can't walk around like this. Come on, please. <laughs> that's the olive grove in here. Thank you. This is a lovely table. I'll go for this one. Thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, thank you very much. Mayday, Mayday. My contact lens has come out. I've been having so many problems with my eye and I just rubbed it. And now it's come out, so Liam's run upstairs to get my contact lens solution. Ah. This is our Greek meze. This looks lovely. The love of my life has gone for lasagna. And then we're sharing an Italian salad. And then I have the goat's cheese, mushroom, and caramelized onion pizza. A bon appetit. So I have gone for the baklava, or baklava. Liam has gone for can you bring it over? Love is letting me have the tap. Come on. All right, here we go. Three, two, one. Oh, that is a stunning tap. Yeah, I'll just test it to make sure it's okay. It's okay. <laughs> We've come outside. Oh, go on. No, it's never as good on the eyes. No, it looks amazing in our eyes, but cameras don't make it as amazing as your eyes do. We've come outside, look at that. We're going at such a speed. It's a little bit windy out here. Even your hair's moving in the wind, babe. <laughs> Must be windy. <laughs> so although I was meant to be having a date night, oh, got no focus, probably for the best. <laughs> um, it's meant to be date night tonight, but date night has come to a bit of an end. I've swapped, uh -huh. I've swapped daddy oh, yeah. for Pearly. Much better swap, I think. What do you think? Yeah. Yeah. Um, I just wasn't in the mood for staying out and having a late night. We've been having a lot of late nights, haven't we? Mm -hmm. We're doing a lot of fun things. 
So we've picked Pearly up a bit early and Pearly's gonna spend some time with me and go to bed. Darcy is still having a lot of fun. You are now, <laughs> you don't look tired. I'm tired. Pearly, this is not a child that is tired, is it? No. <sighs> okay, well, I'm gonna do bedtime routine with Woo! this very tired child and um, I'll be with you shortly. I'm already in my gym jams. This is my current view see me in the reflection but also can you see the sun has just gone down I can see the sea I've brought my duvet into our little conservatory bit for reference that's our bedroom there and then there's like this conservatory it's called a conservatory mini suite I have done a whole room tour of this last year I'll link it below for you and I'm going to carry on reading this book it is a children's book hang on I need to rest my hand on something is this a horrible angle Maybe. It is a children's book, but I really like Jacqueline Wilson books. And since I met her and she gave it to me, I feel like I really want to read it. So no judges, <laughs> but I'm reading a children's book on my holiday. Um, also, I really want to write a children's book. So reading a few is quite good. Like it gives me a good idea of like, kind of the, the, the vibe, like the level that you're aiming it at. Um, so I could call it research, I suppose. Um, but yeah, I think that's me for the night. I'm just going to stay here until Liam gets back with Darcy. I think he's taken her to a show or something like that. Um, I've had a really, really nice day. I really love Hellasild. I just think it's very rugged is the word I'm going to use to describe it. Alden, I think, is really breathtaking. And then Hellasild, I think, is like ruggedly beautiful. Stavanger, I think, is really fresh and interesting if I had to describe all the places we've been so far. And tomorrow we're going to Hogs End, um, but I don't think I'm gonna get off the ship. I really want to explore more of the ship. There's so much to do on the ship. Like you could, even if you were on the ship for a whole week and didn't get off, I still don't think you could do everything. So I really want to do a lot of stuff on Iona tomorrow. And I'm not actually sure if I'll vlog that or if I will like Instagram that. Um, I will let you know one way or another. I'll either tag a bit onto the end of this to be like, that's the end of the series, or there'll be another vlog. Um, but that is the end of this vlog today. Thank you so much for watching. I really hope these vlogs turn out okay. I've just been very relaxed. Like, I feel relaxed. Last night, I felt so relaxed. I was, like, giddy. I had two drinks. But I was like, yeah, I feel so, like, loosey-goosey holiday mode. It was really nice. Um... Anyway, yes, I'm gonna stop waffling because you probably want to get on with your lives and stop watching this video. If you haven't already, please consider giving it a little thumbs up. And um, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, do. I would love to have you. Lots of links and stuff below. Hope these vlogs are turning out all right. That's it from me.